It's possible that Anthony Joshua is facing Daniel Dubois and it's going to be a championship bout for the IBF title. Let's talk about that right now. This is Power Grind Sports, where we're dedicated to the grind and dedicated to you. That's why we do what we do. We talk about the biggest names in sports and entertainment. This is what's hot in the world of sports. We are jumping into the combat sports world, boxing in particular. I got to encourage you first and foremost to turn your dedication into domination. I'm giving you positive energy and information. The International Boxing Federation, yeah, I'm just bars right here. You feel what I'm saying? They are set to make a critical decision on whether or not Anthony Joshua is facing Daniel Dubois in a championship fight. Now, this potential matchup got social media going crazy right now because you know Anthony Joshua, he is solidifying his status to return to the limelight and Dubois is coming off a massively crazy impressive victory over Philippe. Hergovich, right? I did a video on that, so you know, check it out. You got what I'm saying? When I tell you Daniel Dubois is eager for a title shot right now, now the IBF ruling that is getting ready to be announced anytime soon is going to determine if these two British heavyweights are going to get it on and popping for the IBF heavyweight title i'm telling you if it happens it's gonna be a blockbuster showdown now right now the individual that has the ibf belt is the undisputed champion alexander usik you know he defeated tyson fury in riyadh saudi arabia right and became the undisputed heavyweight champion of the world you know now since he He's supposed to fight his mandatory. He's not going to fight his mandatory. That's what it's looking like. Alexander Usyk, he applied for an exemption. The IBF have not made a decision. So if they make a decision and it's against, if they deny the exemption for Usyk, then Anthony Joshua and Daniel Dubois are going to get it on. You feel what I'm saying? So, hey, leave your thoughts in the comment section. What do you think the IBF is going to do? Do you think they're going to decide, you know, to, to make it where Anthony Joshua and Daniel Dubois have to compete for their title? What do you think? Please leave it in the comment section. Also, let me know what you think about Daniel Dubois and his victory over Philippe Hergovich. Did you look at it? Did you like it? Hey, leave it. Leave your thoughts in the comment section. Do you feel what I'm saying? This is Power Grind Sports. You don't get ready to get out of here. But look, man, when I tell you the IBF, man, they always have these complex rules. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm telling you, trying to navigate in boxing, you know, man, it's very difficult dealing with some of these sanctioning bodies. And when you're navigating all these complexities in professional boxing, look, it requires a lot of strategic planning because man these regulatory decisions you know you don't know what these sanctioning bodies are going to do so when i look at anthony joshua and daniel dubois they are prime examples of how victories and organizational um rulings can shape a boxer's career you got what i'm saying the decision of a sanctioning body would you know is going to determine what their um, future trajectory looks like. You feel what I'm saying? So boxers, man, they got to focus on achieving significant wins and they got to stay informed with all of the regulations and they got to be looking for opportunities within the sport because, man, trying to depend on these governing bodies whew, is very, very difficult. So in your life, you got to create pathways to your own success. Now, a lot of times that comes from believing in yourself, having discipline, staying motivated, staying confident, and practicing your skill set, whatever your skill set is. You got what I'm saying? But you got to practice your skill set. Repetition builds you. You feel what I'm saying? But hey, like I said, don't forget to subscribe to Power Grind Sports. Turn your dedication into domination and stay on the grind. I'm out.